so thirsty. Wide shoulders and big traps are the first things you notice on a muscular physique. If it looks like a guy's got built-in shoulder pads, you know he can most likely lift some heavy weight. Today, I'm gonna to show you the best way to build them using only dumbbells. You definitely don't wanna miss this. Today's workout is fueled by Blue Star Nutraceuticals PPK pre-workout, but we'll get to that later in the video. First, I wanna make sure you get what you came here for, which is results. Bigger, stronger shoulders and mountainous traps. So let's get right to it. Most guys struggle to build big traps and shoulders because they train them all wrong. If you've been doing a lot of traditional barbell shrugs and overhead presses, yet aren't seeing the results you've hoped, by the end of this video, you'll know exactly why and what to do instead. So stick with me here. See, contrary to popular belief, your trap muscle fibers don't actually run vertically up your back. They run much more horizontally. So performing traditional upright barbell shrugs really doesn't allow your traps to contract that much at all, which means they aren't being trained effectively. Instead, you need to train them from different angles in ways that allow you to pull back and inwards towards the center of your body. Again, I'll show you the best exercise to do this in just a minute. Similarly, when it comes to building big and noticeable shoulders, most guys only focus on the front delts with various overhead presses and front raises. But it's the side and rear delts that really fill out your shoulders and give them that 3D effect that stands out from every angle. So we'll be going over how to do that with today's workout as well. Now, before we dive in, if you've learned something new already today and can't wait to get this workout started, crush that thumbs up button for me and subscribe to the channel for more great info and workouts like this every week. And share this with a friend that's been struggling to grow his traps or shoulders. All done? Perfect. Let's get going. All great workouts require a great warm up, even for traps and shoulders. So take a good five to 10 minutes and get your muscles and joints warmed up and ready to lift, then let's get going. For this workout, you'll perform seven exercises in linear fashion, meaning you'll perform all sets for exercise one before moving on to exercise two and so on, until all sets of all seven exercises are complete. You'll perform three sets of eight to 12 reps for each exercise, aiming to push yourself until you're only about one rep away from failure, where you can no longer perform a complete rep with proper form. This will ensure you're challenging your muscles enough to stimulate the most amount of muscle growth possible, while still allowing you to recover between exercises and keep training with full intensity. You should use a weight that is roughly 75% of your one rep max for each exercise, which will also be near the weight you would estimate as the max you can lift for about 10 reps. So if you're unsure of your one rep max on shrugs, for example, use your best guess at a weight you can only manage 10 reps with using proper form. That's the weight you should use for this exercise. You're allowed up to 90 seconds to rest and rehydrate with amino fast between sets, but keep the rest times as short as needed to stay focused and keep the pace of the workout up. As always, the complete workout is listed for you in the description below. So let's get going. Exercise number one, chest supported shrug. Set an inclined bench at about 45 degrees and set up with your chest against the bench with a dumbbell in each hand hanging down at your sides. Retract your shoulder blades and then shrug the weight up, squeezing hard at the top, then lower down under control. The forward leaning body position of this movement will cause you to shrug the weights in more of a diagonal direction from your torso rather than straight up and down like traditional shrugs. This forces you to move in better alignment with your trap muscle fibers, allowing you to get a better stretch and contraction in your traps, which means better muscle building results. Exercise number two, Arnold press. Start with your palms facing you at shoulder height. Brace your core and drive the weights overhead. Rotate your palms outwards as you drive to the top, then reverse the motion and lower back down under control. Exercise number three, seated lateral raise. Grab a pair of dumbbells and sit leaning slightly forward. Raise the dumbbells straight out to your sides, keeping your palms facing down and reaching out like you're trying to stretch your arms to the wall. Performing your lateral raises seated will help eliminate momentum in swinging the weights up with your body, forcing greater engagement in your side delts. Exercise number four, reverse delt fly. These are one of the best exercises for isolating the rear delts. Keep your torso parallel to the ground and raise your arms up and out to your sides, keeping your palms facing the ground. Limit the amount of momentum you use with these and really focus on targeting those rear delts. Exercise number five, W raise. Use a seal bench or incline bench to support your chest and let the dumbbells hang straight down on either side. Raise your arms up to the sides while keeping your elbows bent and your thumbs pointing up. Your arms should form a W shape at the top. This allows you to pull your upper arms back further behind your back than regular reverse flies and places your shoulders in an external rotation for greater contraction in the rear delts. 
Control the weight back down and repeat. Exercise number six, leaning one arm upright row. Grab a support and lean away so that your body is about 45 degrees to the ground. Then with your outer arm, perform an upright row with one dumbbell. This will really target the side delts and traps. Just be sure to control the movement and then stop when your elbow is roughly parallel to the floor or when you feel discomfort to avoid running into any shoulder impingement issues. Exercise number seven, farmer's walk. With these, you can either load up handles or grab a pair of heavy dumbbells if you don't have farmer's carry handles. Then you're going to walk for about 50 steps. For the weight on these, you should aim to carry about half of your body weight in each hand for the full time and don't drop them. These seven exercises will produce more dramatic improvements in strength, power, and size of your traps and shoulders than any other dumbbell workout you've performed in the past. I'd bet the house on it. So I can't wait for you to give this a shot and tell me about how it goes in the comment section below. Again, if you've learned something new today or you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and make sure you're subscribed. Now, as promised earlier in the video, it's time to talk about the powerhouse behind this workout that pushes you to train at 100% intensity every rep of every set, each and every workout. Blue Star Nutraceuticals PPK Pre-Workout. Of the dozen or more I've tried, no other pre-workout has come close to the energy and intensity I get from PPK every time. And with the full research-backed dosages of every ingredient, it's amazing they've also been able to make this to be the best tasting pre-workout I've ever had. With flavors like banana popsicle, pina colada, and tons more, if you want to give it a shot and just see how good it really is, go ahead and follow the link in the description below. Then use my code MD10 to save yourself 10% off all the PPK you need along with any other Blue Star Nutraceuticals products for that matter. If you've tried the workout without it today, give this another shot once you get it and compare the two to see how much of a difference it makes right from your first workout. Hit the thumbs up button if you enjoyed today's workout and are ready to start building bigger traps and shoulders and make sure you're subscribed with notifications turned on so you never miss our new videos every week. Keep getting stronger and I'll see you in the next video. Hey guys, if you like this video, check out this one. It's killer. Make sure you're subscribed. You can click the link here if you're not already. And don't miss out on your chance to stock up and save with this incredible offer.